This video is about GMDSS. GMDSS is a global maritime distress and safety system. The basic concept of the GMDSS is that search and rescue authorities ashore, as well as the shipping in the immediate vicinity of the shipping distress, will be rapidly alerted to a distress incident so that they can assist in coordinated SAR operations. The system also provides for urgency and safety. See area A1, an area within the radio telephone coverage of at least one VHF coastal station. See area A2, an area excluding the C area A1, within the radio telephone coverage of at least one MF station. See area A3, an area excluding C areas of A1 and A2, within the coverage of an Inmarsat geostationary satellite in which continuous alerting is available. And the last one, C area A4, an area outside of the areas A1, A2 and A3. VHF, very high frequency radio station radio telephone equipment, which calls initiated by the digital selective calling DC, range up to 30, 50 nautical miles. Of course, it depends on the atmosphere condition and transmitter receiver. MFHF, medium frequency and high frequency radio telephone and radio telex equipment, which calls initiates by the digital selective calling DC. Range vary from the 150 nautical miles to 500 nautical miles. Depends on atmosphere condition and transmitter receiver. An FHF equipment basically can reach distance more than 500 nautical miles. Depends on the atmosphere condition, we can expect that if our vessel located, let's say over here, and receiving station somewhere here, this one is atmosphere. When we transmitting signal from our MFHF antenna, it can be reflected from the atmosphere, then from the land or from the sea, then again from atmosphere, and so on, so on, until it will not reach our receiving station. All of this is called refraction. On the other hand, if you will check what is going on with the VHF signal, it's not reflecting so much, and even if we have some special conditions with the atmosphere, the signal basically will come through the atmosphere and not reflect it. DC. Digital selective call, DC. The standard for sending predefined digital messages via medium frequency, high frequency and very high frequency maritime radio systems. DC is the part of gym business. Thanks to DC, you can make a selective call to some specific vessel or to the group of vessels by the geographic coordinates in Marsat, International Maritime Satellite Organization. Satellite system operated by the Inmarsat company. The types of Inmarsat stations recognized by GMDSS are Inmarsat B, C, and Fleet 77. The Inmarsat C provides ship to shore, shore to ship, and ship to ship store, and forward data and emailing messaging. The capability for sending performated distress messages to Rescue Coordination Center and Inmarsat C Safety Net Service. Safety Net Service is the service of high seas weather warnings, Navaria, Navaria Navigational Warnings, Radio Navigational Warnings, Ice Reports, and warnings generated by, by U.S. Coast Guard, conducted International Ice Patrol, and other similar, and other similar information not provided by the NAFTEX. Safety Net works similarly to NAFTEX in areas outside NAFTEX coverage. NAPTEX system. NAPTEX, an international automated system for instantly distributing maritime safety information, which includes navigational warnings, weather forecasts, and other weather warnings, search and rescue notices, and similar information to the ship. The frequency of transmission of these messages is 580 kHz in English, while 490 kHz is sometimes used for transmitting in local language. The messages are coded in the header. For example, FA56, where F is ID of transmitted station, A is the type of message, A is navigational warning, and 57 is the number of transmitted message. Automatic identification system. AS is not a gym DSS communication system, but it uses VHF radio. A connection to the navigational equipment on board of the ship and the ship's maritime mobile service, MMSI, so it has similar characteristics to the gym DSS equipment. Cage of AAS is required under the regulation of Chapter 5 of SOLAS. AAS provides information including ships identified, type, position, course, speed, navigational status, and other information to the shore station and other ships. AAS also receives such information from other stations. So, for now, it's all.
So that's all for now. On the next video, we will talk about wheelhouse posture and take the system.